Namaskar. I am Anita Sharma and today we are going to continue with our previous topic on fractions. So let us begin with it. So today we are going to learn comparison of unlike fractions. So let us consider the following fractions, 3 fourth and 1 half. So if we are representing them pictorially, we can easily say that 3 fourth is greater than 1 half. So now we are taking the fractions 2 third and 5 sixth. If we represent them pictorially, we can easily say that 2 third is less than 5 sixths. But always it is not so easy to compare fractions pictorially. You know, here uh, the denominators are very small, so it is very easy to represent them pictorially. But if we consider the fractions like 2 elevenths and 3 sevenths, so here division of a whole in 7 or 11 equal parts is not so easy. Or fractions like 17 35ths and 25 eightieths. So here, Equal division of a whole in so many parts is time consuming and not so easy. You know, you can see that here the denominator is 80. So if we are dividing our whole into 80 parts, it will take a lot of time. So we need to find a way so that we can compare the fractions easily. We know that it is very easy to compare like fractions. So to compare unlike fractions, first we convert them into like fractions. So let us understand it by taking examples. Now consider the fractions 3 fifth and 2 third. So aap dekh sakte hain ki in dono fractions mein jo divided part hain wo aapas mein equal nahi hai. To ye like fractions nahi hai. So how can we convert these fractions into like fractions? So yes, we will make their denominators equal. So now denominators equal kaise kare? 5 ko hum 3 to nahi bana sakte. 3 ko hum 5 nahi bana sakte. So we have to think of a number which will be easily 5 and 3 easily convert. So how do we find that number? For that, we are going to take LCM of 3 and 5, which is equal to 15. Means, now we have to cut our whole 15 parts, mein cut karna hai, divide our whole So, 5 parts ko 15 parts. So, we have to that 5 3s are 15. So, now we are going to divide every unit into unit part into 3 parts. So, let us start this part is divided into three part now second part also we are dividing into three parts now third part also we are dividing into three parts and fourth one also uh, into three parts and the last fifth part also we are dividing it into three parts so you can see that this three fifth is converting into nine fifteenth for the shaded part you know, the shaded part which were earlier 3, now they have converted into 9. 3, 3s are 9. And the 5 parts are converted into 15. So, this is our understanding. But we will not make this picture in the notebook. How we will do? Let us see what we are doing. This is 3 fifth. So, we are multiplying it by numerator and denominator by 3. Because 5, 3s are 15 and 3, 3s are 9. So 9 15th and 3 5th, they are equivalent fractions. So chaliye, ab 2 3rd, here we have to divide the 15 parts. So how do we do it? We are showing that 3 5s are 15. That means we are dividing every unit part into 5 parts. So now let us divide this part also in 5 parts and the third one also in 5 parts. So, this is whole 15 parts and here it is divided in 15 parts. So, now what is the fraction? 2 third is now, for the shaded part it is 10 fifteenths. These two parts shaded, now they are converted into 10. 5 and 5, 10. 
and three parts convert it into 15. So how we will uh, do the working for it? This is two third. How to make this denominator 15? We are going to multiply numerator and denominator by five. So this is equal to two fives are 10 and three fives are 15. So now, आप देख रहे हैं कि हमने अपने होल को जो कि पहले 5 और 3 में डिवाइडेड थे अब दोनों ही 15 पार्ट में डिवाइड हो गए दैट मींस वी हैव कन्वर्टेड देम इनटू लाइक फ्रैक्शंस सो इंस्टेड ऑफ कंपेयरिंग 3 5th एंड 2 3rd वी आर गोइंग टू कंपेयर 9 15th एंड 10 15th बिकॉज़ दे आर लाइक व्हाट इज अ रूल टू कंपेयर लाइक फ्रैक्शंस ग्रेटर द न्यूमरेटर ग्रेटर द फ्रैक्शंस or we can say that smaller the numerator, smaller the fractions. So 9 15th is less than 10 15th. So 3 5th is less than 2 3rd. Easy? Chalye, ek aur example lete hai. So we are considering fractions 4 5th and 3 4th. You can see that they are not like. So to make them like, what we have to do? We are going to make the denominators equal. तो हमें फिर से एक ऐसा नंबर ढूंढना है जिसने 5 और 4 इजीली कन्वर्ट हो जाएं सो फॉर दैट वी आर गोइंग टू टेक एलसीएम ऑफ 5 एंड 4 व्हिच इज इक्वल टू 20 सो so अब हमें अपने होल को 20 पार्ट्स में डिवाइड करना है तो कैसे करेंगे जल्दी से करते हैं दिस इज 4 5th सो 5 कैन बी वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट इट 20 सो 5 4 आर 20 सो वी आर गोइंग टू मल्टीप्लाई न्यूमरेटर एंड डिनोमिनेटर बाय 4 so, 4 4s are 16 and 5 4s are 20. So, now 5 4 is converted into 16 20 -ths. So, they are equivalent. You can see here, this is 16 20 -ths. So, actually, what we have done when we are multiplying by 4 means we have divided every unit part into 4 parts. So, 4 parts are converted into 16. And five parts are converted into twenty. So, चलिए अब हम three fourth को करते हैं जल्दी से कैसे करते हैं? हमें denominator twenty बनाना है. So, हमारे पास हमारा denominator four है. So, we are going four five are twenty. We are going to multiply numerator and denominator by five. So, three five are fifteen and four five are twenty. So, three fourth and fifteen twentieth are equivalent. You can see here. They are equal. जो हमारा whole four part में divided था, वो twenty part में divide हो गया है. तो जो हमारे three parts considered थे, now they have converted into fifteen parts. तो जब हमने इसे five से multiply किया, तो actual में क्या हुआ? Just see, each unit part is divided into five parts. तो five threes are fifteen and five fours are twenty. तो जो हमारी fractions थी four fifth और three fourth, now they have converted into like fractions sixteen twentieths and fifteen twentieths. So instead of comparing four fifth and three fourth, we are going to compare sixteen twentieths and fifteen twentieths. So they are like. So greater the numerator, greater the fraction. So 16 20th is greater than 15 20th. So we can say that 4 5th is greater than 3 4th. Seems easy? Okay. So चलिए सोचते हैं कि is there any shortcut method to compare the fractions? Yes. That is cross multiplication method. So चलिए देखते हैं 5 8 and 2 6. They are not like fractions. So, we are going to cross multiply. We are going to multiply the denominator of 2, 6 with the numerator of 5, 8. And the denominator of 5, 8 with the numerator of 2, 6. So, 6, 5s are 30 and 8, 2s are 16. So, numerator to our 16 or 30. Ho what is happening with the denominator? So, let's see the denominator. Mein kya ho so, when we are multiplying numerator by 5, 6, so we have to uh, multiply denominator also by 6. So, here, when we are multiplying 2 with 8, means numerator by 8, so we have to multiply denominator also by 8. So, numerator is 5, 6 are 30 and 
Here, two eights are 16. But what is the denominator? Let us see. Eight six are 48. And six eights are also 48. So, when we are cross multiplying, so our fractions, they are automatically converting into like fractions. So, our base is the same as we have the denominator equally. And it is the same as we have cross multiply. Karne se. So, what we are going to do? We are ignoring denominators. And we are only comparing numerators. So, 30 is greater than 16. So, we can say that 5, 8 is greater than 2, 6. Easy? Okay. Now, let us recapitulate. To compare fractions, we have learnt three cases. Case 1, when fractions have equal denominators. Sabhi tukde ek jaise hain. So, what is the rule? Greater the numerator, greater the fraction. Case 2, when fractions have equal numerators, means considered parts are equal. Then how we compare? Greater the denominator, smaller the fraction. So, jo considered part, if we cut the number of parts, then the considered part will be small, small. So now today we have learned case three, when fractions do not have equal denominators, means they are unlike. So how to compare them? The rule says convert the fractions into like fractions and then compare. Okay, now let us apply the learned rules to compare the fractions. Now, this is three fifth and three eighth, which is this case? We can see that numerators are equal. So this is case 2. How to compare? Greater the denominator, smaller the fraction. So we can say that 3 fifth is greater than 3 eighth. Now take the fractions 2 ninths and 5 ninths. Which is this case? Denominators are equal. So this is case 1. What is the rule? Greater the numerator greater the fraction. So 2 ninth is less than 5 ninths. Now take the fractions 2 third and 3 fifth. So you can see that neither numerators are equal nor denominators are equal. So this is case 3. So what is the rule? Convert the fractions into like fractions and then compare. So how can we convert them into like fractions? So let us cross multiply. So 5 2s are 10 and 3 3s are 9. Or denominators to apne aap equal ho hi jayenge. So 10 is greater than 9. So we can say that 2 3rd is greater than 3 5th. Okay. I hope all the cases are very clear in your mind. Just to strengthen the uh, topic, you have to watch this video again and again. And then just fix the rules in your mind, but with understanding. Visualize them and practice a lot. I, I think that you will not face any difficulty in comparing the fractions. So thank you for watching the video.